the fastest growing history of YouTube against the Streamies Entertainer of the Year, which was basically according to resources rigged, but he's still the Entertainer of the Year. He will be the quickest, reaching its closest by subscribers milestone. Will it be FuzzyTube? Will it be Raska? So today's video is going to be a battle that was requested by someone. Hey guys, welcome to another video of YouTube Battles, episode 2 of YouTube Battles. Last video was Joe Weller against Casey Neistat and Casey Neistat just took it by, by, by a margin or two because he's already on, he reached 5 million subscribers like 2 weeks ago so that's insane and Joe Weller hasn't even reached 4 million so the winner of that one is Casey Neistat just as I predicted. Today, in today's episode will be FuzzyTube, better known as Yusuf Erekat, against, sorry if I pronounced it wrong, against Raskam, also known as Brian Lee. I don't, I don't think it's pronounced Lee because there's only one E, but I'm pronouncing Lee because I don't know how to pronounce it, so sorry again. Today's winner will be determined by our rules. Okay, there's no rules basically because there's, they're not really, they're not here and competing, but the winner of today's episode will be determined by who's going to reach the closest bar subscribers milestone. In this case for Raskam it's 5 million and for FuzzyTube it's 10 million. Before you get into this video make sure to smash the like button. Let's hit 15 likes this time. Last video got 12. I think. We got 12 likes so try and smash 15 likes in this video. Subscribe if you like my content. Subscribe if you're new around here. And let's get into the video. Raskam at the moment is on 4,540,039 subscribers. Which means he's off by 459,951. 61. FuzzyTube, on the other hand, is on 9,637,642 subscribers. This makes him 362,358 subscribers off the 10 million mark. But let's get into some background. So, FuzzyTube, also known as Yusuf Saleh Arakat, who was born on 22nd of January 1990. He was born in Fremont, California. Uh, his parents are, have a Palestinian background, but he's American. And he has three siblings, two brothers and one sister. Graduated from San Jose State University and then moved to Los Angeles where he's still at now. FuzzyTube had, or Yusef, had multiple channels, which was not called FuzzyTube, he had fitness channels. And this is where he became an inspiration to people and a motivation to people and that's why he got so famous. Because before he started YouTube he was kind of fat, he, was, he had a bit of weight on him. And he transformed into being who he is now. Uh, a muscular guy, quite muscular and quite, looks quite strong. He started in a couple of movies, uh, actor slash YouTuber slash rapper. So he started his channel on uh, the 21st of March 2011 and he's generated over 1.4 billion views. And before someone says the, it's impossible because there's only 7 million people in the world, well you're wrong. Okay, you're wrong. Raskam was born on the 9th of November 1996. His origin is from Nevada so I presume that he's born in Nevada and he currently stays in Las Vegas and this is where he is at the moment now. Uh, he got famous for roasting people basically and his father's Jacob Sartorius was also that's what made him grow and he's a fastest grower in YouTube history. He grew 2.5 million subscribers in less than four months. Most, he has a series like Joe Weller, the Intimate Mult, he has a series called These Kids Must Be Stopped. And he's making fun out of kids which are acting like idiots and like you just go watch it, it was really really good. Raskam started his channel on 24th of September 2012 and he's generated over 300 million views. The most popular video of FuzzyTube is a Spider-Man real life prank. It generated over 128 million views. Raskam's most famous video is These Kids Must Be Stopped, the very first episode of his series, which is the most famous series he has, besides roasting people. Generated over 10 million views. Go to some pros and cons. So FuzzyTube he has consistent views in this video, he always gets the same amount of views. He also connects with his fans which makes him, he has a large fan base and that's that's the reason why he won the streamies because it was purely based on fan votes. Also pros his motivational videos when he started YouTube with the one that I talked about earlier with, uh, with him being kind of fat and then turning into who he is now. That inspired a lot of people, it motivated a lot of people. Now cons, uh, fake pranks, I mean no one believes his pranks anymore. He always gets exposed for fake pranks, which is a huge thing because that was his, cha his channel was based around that uh, pranks and 
All of his pranks are getting exposed, man. It's actually ridiculous how many fake pranks he actually did. Con, the second most hated YouTuber at the moment. Uh, the number one is obviously the guy with no chin. And number two, uh, if you don't know who that is, just type in no chin YouTube and you'll first search, you'll fucking see it. Uh, but he's currently the second most hated YouTuber, especially what happened to the Streamy Awards, the fake pranks, uh, especially him uh, bullying kids. I think that he bully. I think he bullied the No Chin fan, and what is being said about him from the drama channels such as Scares Drama Alert, which is the best drama channel, Drama Alert definitely worth a check out. I'm gonna leave their link in the description as well. Proof of him rigging, but I don't know if you can really call it rigging because. He can vote 200 thumbs a day, which is, that's why he can vote 200 thumbs a day. And his fans did it, but he kept on pushing the fans to do it in the description of his videos. Um, Keemstar, I think, uh, exposed him for that. Or, I, I don't know, but it was one of the drama channels that actually picked it up. And so, there, there's rumors that are rigging it. But now, Raska, he's the fastest grower in YouTube history. Gets consistent views in his video. Uh, these Kids Must Be Stopped series is a advantage to him because he did a lot of his fan base watch it and that's where a lot of his fans came from from roasting people uh, obviously it's pure for the band and some people take it too literal and then they start hating his videos especially is he always has a storyline behind it I mean sometimes when he has the afro gum with it, it like really creates a storyline in the video itself which is really which makes it like kind of authentic and really kind of interesting to watch also last one he connects with his audience just like Free YouTube he connects with his audience, which is awesome. <laughs> and disadvantage he has for me, and it's not really a disadvantage, it's just it's good, but it's not good because he got a lot of hate for it at one stage, and then uh, what he just got a lot of hate from it in one stage, which is he got famous by roasting people. <laughs> at the moment, I've got a hundred percent success rate, which makes me very likely to get this one right as well. So today's winner, or the winner of this episode. Which will be the guy that will reach its closest bar subscriber milestone is Raska. I, I really like Fuji Tube, but I think he won't reach 10 million subscribers before R Raska will reach 5 million subscribers because 10 million subscribers is a big one. It's a big one. And the rate at which the subscribers gain is per day is Raska is definitely gonna take it. And Fuji Tube, he's gaining subscribers at the moment, he's starting to pick up again. The last two weeks he's been losing subscribers, and that's what that's what make, makes me think that Raskam will take this one. Raskam will be the first one to reach 5 million subscribers. Then FuzzyTube reach 10 million subscribers. Thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. And make sure to hit the thumbs up if you think I'm right. And if you think I'm wrong, hit the thumbs up as well. Comment on who you think will win this episode. FuzzyTube or Raskam. And if you want me to do other ones like YouTube battles, make sure to comment down below. Give me two YouTubers and I'll do them. Bang. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to smash a like. And subscribe if you're new around here, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Cheers.